10 women who served our country will get a total beauty makeover today, all thanks to a partnership between a local beauty spa and a nonprofit organization. 13 Action News reporter Alicia Patillo shows you what's in store for those deserving ladies uh, later today. Alicia. Good morning, Dave. Our veterans worked hard, so they should play hard, right? Today is all about uh, honoring and showing love to those who have sacrificed so much for our country and for all of us. And so what better way to say thank you than to be pampered? Check this out. Our mission here at Squad is to help working women who are trying to balance their professional lives and their personal care needs. And so what better person other than a military veteran? First, Stephanie Ryder, owner of Squad Beauty Professionals and military veteran, juggling her professional career and personal life has been a challenge. Through her beauty business, she found a way to express herself while helping others. When COVID-19 forced her to cancel her plans for Veterans Day, she came up with another idea, a spa day honoring female veterans. With help from Women's uh, Veteran Co., a nonprofit organization, they are giving 10 veterans a day of pampering. The spa service will include a beauty and skin makeover, an education course, food, and of course, sisterhood. Ryder says sometimes self-care is all you need to see your true beauty. Being in the military, you know, it's always service before sale. Mm -hmm. And so, it, you know, it, it can become a struggle sometimes. And it's really about making sure that you take care of yourself at the end of the day. As women, you know, we've been conditioned to, believe, uh, to take care of everyone else. And I'm really about making women put themselves first and understanding that you can't take care of anyone else until you take care of yourself. Very wise words. Uh, Stephanie says that COVID-19 guidelines will be in place all day today for the veterans, and she's hoping to continue to uplift women and all veterans for many years to come. Alicia Batillo, 13 Action News. Thanks, Alicia. And here at 13 Action News, we offer support to all those amazing veterans in our community during these unprecedented times.